sir. It's a real sort of changing of the guard mm -hmm. this season with Even there Melly. being a new administration. Melly Grant is in her monumental we, man. You know, we she's pick up to a hundredth episode, a hundredth day in her administration in the first episode, and Olivia Pope is running B six thirteen, which was always her arch enemy. I mean, you know, her dad and B six thirteen. It was sort of everything that she was against. You know, I mean, it was sort of the enemy, and now she's in charge. Of, of the and so you get a new Olivia Pope, you get a new administration. There's a new crisis management firm, Quinn Perkins and Associates, right here. I think Quinn Perkins and Associates is better than Olivia Pope. <laughs> 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 right now, Quinn Perkins and Associates is struggling. You're gonna go with Q, QPA. 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 All QPA. you gotta do is put a slash in the yeah. O. Yeah. Do I mean, you know that? I mean, the T-shirts, the yeah. name on the door. All That's you gotta right. do is put so one easy. line. It's easy. Saves money on the business cards. You just put a slash We're in. We're struggling a little bit. You do have <laughs> yeah. to find to drum up business, That's but right. it's gonna be okay. But that's where I we hope. start off. Like we're we're definitely scrapping and we're having no to one trusts Quinn Perkins and Associates. It doesn't just have that ring. That not only do people not trust had. Quinn Perkins, nobody knows who <laughs> Quinn Perkins is. Well, because so. she's a, she used to be Lindsay Dwyer. She's also pregnant. It's all very confusing. <laughs> I was gonna say congratulations so in real life. Thank yeah. you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank uh, you. What is what is a baby on Scandal even like? What is that? How is? I can't wait to see. Like a character having a baby? <laughs> yeah. I don't know. We haven't <laughs> had. I guess Melly had Teddy. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Melly had Teddy, but I. It was I so surreal, a, though. I like know. this last at the end of last season when you came to Abby and said, "I'm pregnant with Charlie's baby," and there was this whole like weird. That was so hormonal. Yeah, I mean, she was emotional because she is pregnant. Yeah, I had was to, pregnant, and you hadn't even told. Had you told any? She hadn't even told anybody yet. Like I had told you, just told you the cast, guys. But it wasn't, you didn't publicly say no. it yet. So there was this, I mean, it was like this parallel universe. So I was like at the table read with like 150 yeah. people and Quinn says I'm pregnant yeah. and I'm pregnant. But now the whole cast and crew knows Quinn's pregnant. I mean, it was like so meta on yeah. so many levels. So fun. Um, but it's really one. I mean, there's no better place for baby stuff than Shonda Land. There's right. just not. And Carrie is the biggest inspiration <laughs> and role model to just being a badass yeah. working mom. Yep. Didn't stop working. No. Like, at so all. I'm I mean, like, well, I have no excuse and I can't complain that my feet are swollen. Yeah, but you don't. <laughs> you don't complain. So, so far. So far. Not gonna work. So, Scandal's always been mm. very girl power, but it feels especially like like that this season. We have with, a female president. Yeah, yeah. With female president. Olivia female Lane chief of staff. Female I mean, how does that feel kind of management. going into this final season with like, it's the women who are fully in charge of pretty much everything? Feels better than You know what? I'm, gonna, I'm going to mirror what Olivia Pope says at the very end of the episode um, of season six when Cyrus says, so how's it feel? And she says it feels right. Mm -hmm. That's how it feels. It yeah. feels right. It does. It totally feels right. It just feels good. How can people prepare themselves? for this final season? What should they be ready for? Well, they should definitely watch the last season again. Yeah. I just did that for Game of Thrones. It was the best. I yeah. like highly recommend you it. You sort of, yeah, I get prepped. Because I, you don't really, and Scandal, so many things happen in one mm -hmm. episode that like you really yes. need to prep yourself Especially again. Especially the, the last episode, like yeah. right leading into this with everyone Melly's changed inauguration. The guard and, all of that. Yes. I would watch that. Tweet us. Mm -hmm. Tell get us ready you're to excited. Live tweet. Get your thumbs warmed up. October 5th. So get your mm -hmm. snacks in order and your phone charged up. Get that popcorn. Right. Get that wine. Red wine. Get all that stocked up. Tell your friends because it's more fun to watch <laughs> yes, at a party. It's true. Yeah. True. Yeah, um, this is the last year to have scandal watch parties. Yeah, which people love. Yeah. And like you can play that scandal game and every single time. David Rosen says, says I'm, I'm the, the Attorney, Attorney General, General of the United, United States. States. You drink. <laughs> you drink. <laughs>